After years, after years of reckless, <laughs> after years, after years of reckless plowing, this modern woman now wants a good man. Thrill, 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 thrill. So after many, many years of reckless, breakneck, <laughs> raw, <laughs> unhinged, hinged, bust off. After years of the most depraved animalistic bust downs that this woman or any woman has ever had, this woman or some women come to the conclusion that, yeah, you know what, I don't think my vag can take it anymore. I probably just want to get a decent man. I am genuinely confused by women. I understand that when you're a teenager, you're like, oh, bad boys. Ugh. But once you mature a little bit, hopefully, you're not actually looking for them anymore. But this is the face that women make when a sensitive and nice guy comes into their life. Why? I am 27 and only now have I come across a nice, sensitive gentleman. No, like you've just said, only now you start to notice and realize and appreciate those sorts of men. What some women don't understand, unless some dudes are desperate, many dudes would be like, no, nah, I'm good. As some dudes would say, not myself, I wouldn't say such things. Some dudes would say, well, damn, you got ran through and now you want to find a decent man. Nope. To some dudes, that doesn't matter. To other dudes, that's not fair because I'm going to go out and every other guy we're going to see is going to be, what, one of your ex dudes. A dude that's did you in so many ways, like, nah, that's not, that's not appealing at all. Do you know how many years I've spent being treated like fucking garbage? But you did enjoy it though. Men, when women say this, do not think for a second they weren't having fun. Oh shit! Don't believe that nonsense. They were having fun. They wouldn't have tolerated it for so long. Come on. But some men do fall for the, oh, 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 I made a mistake act and believe it. Like, please, woman, please. Did you believe it when you had your ankles behind your head? Bye, bad boys. It's not fucking cute anymore. Do you know how nice it is to finally have somebody care about you? Somebody who actually thinks about you? Somebody who you can actually trust to be away from for more than, I don't know, five minutes without thinking, who the fuck is he talking to? The interesting point about that, a point I've made before as well, and I've shown you women making this point. Again, yes, there are random dudes that, you know, they'll see a nice chicken like go for her, okay? But as some dudes understand, it's never one shot. I can't ever shoot my shot at one chick, it's pointless. Scatter shot. Hung, 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 hung. See how many women I could lay down with one spray. Hung, 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 hung. I don't know what kind of gun that is. No. Hung, 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 hung. And that's of, you know, I shouldn't have to say it's penis. Pe penis. Oh, God. Penis. Just, just to clarify, you shoot, you know, you knock them down with your penis. Just to clarify, that's what you're laying them down with. I shouldn't have to say that because I've ruined, I've ruined this segment. But, you know, just to clarify. So some men understand it's pointless. Even if I've got this woman here, it's not what I'm saying, but some men, you know, you know I'm just saying, even if I've got this woman here, lovely woman, lovely woman, you know, you say she's gorgeous or whatever, you can lie to her and yourself, whatever. Yes, at the same time, you've probably got one or two, three. You've got some more women in your phone. Backup chicks. One of them's probably a practice chick that you practice with. Just to, you know, just... You understand. So some women should understand it doesn't work this way. To the one, You can't be a savvy, oh, great talker to one woman. It doesn't work like that. That skill develops over many, many, many women. So even though it's wrong, to some degree, it kind of helps as a man to run through these. Not, oh, that's wrong. Because I know most of you know exactly what I'm talking about when I say that. And that's not just some insecurity thing. That's a, your boyfriend's a piece of trash and he's talking to fucking God knows how many women behind your back and you know it. Sensitive men are beautiful beings. Shut up, bitch. Sensitive men are slowly dying out. A lot of men pretend to be so nowadays to get women into, you know, bed or relationships. And then when they're done, they move on. She wasn't mine anyway. I have never felt so healthy and thriving in my life since my sensitive boyfriend came into my life. I fucking love it. Poor guy, poor guy. I fucking love it. That's cat. He's probably a very good guy. That's what's so effed up about this. He's probably a very good guy. But why didn't she date him six, seven years ago? You deserve to have somebody tell you that they miss you and that you're beautiful every single day. I know you want to hear it. We all do. Even men want to hear it. Men want to hear that they're beautiful and that they're appreciated and that we miss them. Not really. Nowadays, I want to hear if you swallow or not. Drop the ego. Raise the standards a bit. And find a guy who's not a complete tosspot. Follow me for more relationship advice. 
Yeah, once you start hitting the wall, then you find a decent man. Hang, 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 hang!